It's gonna feel just like the first time we went out Wanna love you, hold you, kiss you for the rest of our lives It's the night I saw it on your day, the mom and dad Hey guys, we're headed down to Sydney Market, it's date number four and we're going to check out a bunch of local businesses down there as well as going to our favorite restaurant, Sabai Thai. So tonight's tip will be um, have a plan. There has been so many times where Adam and I on our date nights would jump into the car and we would not know where we were going. So we'd go to the end of the street and we'd say right or left and then we'd end up just going to the same restaurants over and over and over and I would be really bored. So have a plan. And just a little side note, um, we planned this date night in Sydney before Wade and Banch did so if we end up running into them on our date, they copied our date. We didn't copy them, they copied us. So let's, I just want to get that straight before you see it happen, because it might happen. <laughs> All right. So we're here in the Sydney market, and uh, right behind us there's tons of people, and we're just heading down this way over here. We have a lot of shopping to do here, so uh, yeah. We are here at Sabai Thai, and uh, we just ordered the uh, sweet chili Thai wings and a uh, medium spiced pad thai, chicken pad thai, and uh, it's going to be really good. We just had a really spicy Uh, Sydney, we're out here. Dog, nice little, nice little fish market over there, a little restaurant. Um, just wanted, <laughs> wanted to uh, apologize. Uh, no, no, it's it's yeah, good. Thank you, you very you much. Yeah, yeah, thank you. <laughs> uh, um, Nice uh, commenters there. Um, just wanted to apologize about uh, dinner and not showing too much of it because we ended up having a, a little bit of a fight um, <laughs> and uh, got into some heated moments and just left the camera aside. Um, <laughs> next time maybe we'll grab it and get some of the action shots. Um, what did we... What did we learn? <laughs> Actually, what happened? <laughs> um, it was pretty so interesting. <laughs> like, come on. We don't need to get into details. But it did, there was a point where... I wanted to run away. <laughs> she wanted to run away, she said, I'm out of here. I said, fine, you go take the bus, I'll drive home. <laughs> Which is terrible. We'd, I'd never make her take the bus home, but it's fun to say in the heat of the moment. Um, yeah, pretty heated debate we had going. It was a fight, not a debate. I've been telling him for years that we suck at communication. We were walking to this pier, and um, Adam finally said, We, we, suck, at we suck at communication. So and that's. So yeah. It's a good place to be. Hey, we realize we suck, and now we get to work on it. So uh, we might be giving Dr. Jack and Levana a call. <laughs> <laughs> who are awesome marriage well, counselors. It's all good. Yeah. Oh, here we go. Down the market. And we're just heading down this way to see what's going on down here. We ended up finding Wade and Ranch. And uh, like I told you before already, we, uh, we had this plan long before they did. And they, uh, <laughs> what did you guys do? Date night. Well, They're just copying us. We actually just took some uh, two sets of Sabai Thai wings that are the most mm. incredible wings you'll ever have in your entire life. Funny, they got wings too. Mm. <laughs> so one thing you have to do in the Sydney market 
I okay. don't fight like we <laughs> But one person that stood up to us today was the owner of one amazing story. You gotta go to his booth, have one of those delicious Belgian waffles. They're like unlike anything you've ever had. Um, and ask him his story because it's pretty amazing. Check it out, have a waffle, and listen to his story. We are now here at Starbucks and uh, we split a large decaf coffee into two containers and it's officially the worst coffee that I've ever had. But I'm going to drink it because I bought it. Um, <laughs> it's terrible. You should not have to add cream or sugar to a coffee. If you do, there's something wrong. There's something wrong. It's adulterated and it's wrong. <laughs> um, but this is loaded with sugar and cream just to cover up the disgusting taste. But anyways, um, yeah, it was a good day night. We actually feel really close now. Uh -huh, it's After amazing. our argument, we've seen where we went wrong. We've apologized. We decided to move forward and grow, and even get some some professional counseling, which is not. <laughs> It's not funny and it's not a bad thing. It's no, good. It isn't. Preventing issues is better than dealing with them after. So That's right. um, we wanted to do a shout out tonight to Becky Jai. Our, um, the best the nanny. Best nanny. On block. And uh, she's even more than that. Yeah, and she's single. Also to Mark uh, Whitting, um, we just appreciate you so much and your support to us. I think you're amazing. Um, you bless us every time. We see you and we hear from you and seeing what you're doing online, it's awesome. And then also uh, the third person we want to, to do a shout out to is Chuck Campos. Yes. One of our biggest fans, <laughs> self-proclaimed biggest fan of Date Night Diaries. Um, you rock. We love you. Yes. Love you. Can't wait to see you again. So, um, you are a big ball of energy and fun. Not big like the <laughs> shape, but like uh, big in uh, personality. Personality. Yes. Yeah. Awesome. Okay. Love we love everyone. We love you all. <laughs> We're just full of love tonight. <laughs> love. <laughs> yes, yeah, speak it, brother. <laughs> love, everybody. Love. <laughs> Still alive.